So I want to tell you about the Callaway Mac Daddy 2 design. These are brand new wedges from Callaway. Quite a nice uh, work that they put into these, very different than their former X-Line, and yet still inspired by uh, their name, Mac Daddy, which came from, of course, Phil Mickelson, who, uh, when he first hit the, the first wedges that they were made uh, for him when he came over to Callaway, he said that the grooves on that and the spin that they created, that that was the Mac Daddy spin that he wanted out of a wedge. So again, the Mac Daddy 2 kind of named after that, and of course they've kept those tolerances extremely uh, close to the USGA limits with these grooves. Now Roger Cleveland designed these, and you can see his footprint all over these wedges. Beautiful craftsmanship. He's done some nice engraving here on the back. He's got three different grinds. He's got a U grind, which is for a guy that's taking a steeper attack at the wedge, somebody like Mickelson, somebody with a steep attack. Uh, that wedge also for somebody who plays in real soft conditions, that kind of thing. Then a C grind, which uh, has relief on the heel and the toe, allows you to be crafty around the greens. You want to open the club up. You're going to have a little more relief on the toe to be able to do that. And then a standard grind, which is somebody that's sort of in between, somebody that's got sort of a, not so steep, but not such a picker, somebody that's more of a standard player. Now, two different finishes here, as I said, a chrome finish and a vintage finish with a forged wedge with a 1020 uh, steel. This is a very soft uh, steel, so you're gonna get a, a really nice feel off of these wedges, and that's exactly what I found. They have, uh, like I said, a tolerance, the way that they etch the grooves in there that's right up to the USGA limits, so you're gonna get a lot of spin. Now, let me tell you what I found out when I hit them. I've got a 52 and a 56. Out of the sand, I can tell you, they were very, very good. Um, I could hear a click out of the sand on just about every shot that I hit. That told me that I was getting great contact, the bounce was working well, and I was getting that nice spin on the ball out of the sand, which I really like to see that off a wedge. A lot of times you don't see that, so that was really great. They're a little smaller, so around the greens and just uh, out of the fairway, I found them to be a little lighter, a little smaller than other wedges, but I was able to have a lot of control with them, so I did like that about them. Uh, I think I've got the C grind, I think that's a good grind for me. Um, I am a little steeper though, so maybe the U grind would have been a, a better choice. Just really well built, solid wedges. I was really able to control the ball, hit a little higher shot, hit a little knockdown shot, get some spin on a ball. So all in all, my review of the Callaway Mac Daddy 2 wedges is that these are very well designed. Uh, obviously, when you have Roger Cleveland doing that work for you, you're gonna get a great product. Um, I love the 1020, that gives them a real soft feel. I love the way that he's uh, put the etch into the face and you see the spin, you see the control. The grind for me was awesome out of the sand, uh, so I really like that uh, C grind on these wedges. All in all, I, th I would tell you that these are a quality product, something that you would be happy to have in your bag. Please head over to golflife.com. We've got all kinds of video reviews of different products like these great wedges from Callaway Golf and we're hoping that these reviews will help your golf life.